Welcome to another Experts Talks. Transmission and distribution networks are faced with significant structural and operational changes, such as increasing consumption, further deregulation and intermittent power generation in feed. Today, Udo Faubel from Siemens Energy Automation Product Promotion will speak about products that will monitor the network, which help ease transportation bottlenecks and improve grid stability. Welcome, Udo. How is Siemens supporting its customers to overcome instability issues in their networks? We are promoting phaser measurement units for our wide area monitoring system, so-called SeaGuard Phaser Data Processor to observe dynamic behavior in networks, for example, power oscillations caused by changes in the load and falls or other system disturbances. And how can the dynamic behavior in the network be measured? Let me show you this on a graphic. Here we see IEDs, preferably Zipotec 5 devices. We are measuring phasers, that means the amplitude and phase angle of currents and voltages at strategical points in the network. Combined with GPS time signals, we call these phasers phaser measurement unit, according to IEEE C37118. This data will be collected, archived and processed by a phaser data concentrator, which is located in a control center. And what are the applications for wide area monitoring systems? Typical applications on wide area monitoring systems are power swing recognitions, islanding detections, and voltage stability calculation. I like to show you this on the user interface. Here on this graphic, you will see the user interface of SeaGuard PDP. The highlight of this user interface is the visualization in real time. On the top of this user interface, we see the power system status curve, which is a kind of fever curve of the network. Violations of defined limits are indicated in red colored areas. A map with colored scheme overlaid to a geographical map is showing, for example, violations of limits in voltage, current, angle differences, power swings and islanding conditions. In the center, we see a chart view and a vector diagram. On the right hand side we have a list of all measurements which are available in this monitored system. The bottom shows the event list with microsecond exact timestamp information. Thank you for showing me that. Now who are the customers and what can they do with the information of the SeaGuard user interface? Customers are transmission system operators. With the increased observability the user can select critical timeframes for detailed analysis that helps control center staff to find the cause of the violations of limits and to take countermeasures. And what is the benefit for these customers? The main benefits for these customers is the better understanding in dynamic behaviors. The user will be able to improve their operational system, the SCADA system, and for example, possibly also their protection scheme. I'm sure that in mid and long term, SeaGuard PDP will deliver a significant improvement of the network stability. Thank you, Udo, and I wish you all the best. Thank you. Siemens SeaGuard Phaser Data Processor is used by transmission and distribution networks to monitor power networks in real time and to show the dynamic behavior at a glance in an attractive user interface that shows results. This enables control center staff to analyze limitation violations and optimize the secure operation of their grid.